Hello, good evening. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to day... What is this? I think this is day seven, right? I got my little sketch here. Yeah, this is episode 119, day seven of 365 days. Day seven, so um, I want to... Hey, hello, guys. Hey, Fatima. Good to see you on YouTube. Hey, Brian, Brain O'Brien, how are you? Hey, Annie on YouTube. And uh, hey, Genghis Khan on YouTube. Day 7 of 365 days. We're going to draw, this is our last lesson of the um, chapter 1 for this for this round, for this time around, okay? So we're, this, this first week, 7 days, we've been going through, uh, you can draw in 30 seconds, we've been going through uh, chapter 1. It's all about the sphere and learning how to control the sphere with the overlapping and the horizon, the shading, and uh, working on our different time challenges. This Remember, the time challenges on page 30 in the book. I hope you guys all get a copy of the book. Go to Amazon, and uh, or you go to my website at the top, and you can order it from my website. And uh, time challenges that build up your drawing instinct, your drawing confidence, and your drawing enthusiasm, so you want to practice more, okay? These are really good. Each each week, we'll be going through a different sheet. So uh, next week, we are working on the, the cube. We're going to be working on the box, the cube, all right? And we're going to be stacking them. We're going to be putting windows and doors. It's going to be really cool. And embellishing next week and it is the what is the let me see here boy there's a lot of pages of embellishing it's the yellow pencil level the level two the yellow pencil club level that's starting tomorrow okay so today today we're working on um this right here you see this right here this one this is uh Level six, this is in the white pencil uh, skill level, okay? This is the, the level six, the floating house. There's no time limit, it's just practicing the floating house. Isn't that fun? So that's what we're going to draw right now, okay? This is one I did earlier uh, at uh, with another class about a year or so ago. All right, so let's get going here. I'm going to get my spacer, and I'm going to identify where... Where my little guy is going to go, I'm going to put it about right there. That's my template to kind of figure out. Remember, our goal is one drawing every day, no matter what, okay? One drawing every day, no matter what. And even if you're just logging in today, that's fine. Just join us every day from here on. You don't have to do all 365 in order to, to uh, benefit from the challenge. I figure... Even if you miss, you know, a month of these lessons, you still, it's over 300 days of drawing this year. You're really going to get, you're really going to build up skill. Um, hello, uh, everybody on Facebook. I have Bush and Genghis Khan and Brain O'Brien, Brain O'Brien and Annie. Bottom line, anybody on uh, uh, Facebook? Let me know if you're on Facebook. I want to know if I successfully got on the Facebook. All right. So we're going to start right here. We're going to draw a, a box. I'm going to put two dots straight across from each other. All right. I'll start with a box down here. Let me zoom this out so you can see. So there's my space. That's my page. Let me just zoom up really far so you can see. I put the, the this will be the target area. See that? All right. And then I'll zoom back in. Put your finger in the middle. I'm going to, this is a little sneak peek to uh, starting tomorrow, Monday. We'll work on day eight, which would be uh, the first day of our chapter two of You Can Draw in 30 Seconds. Okay, so I'm going to draw a, blo a block here. Uh, hello, Ivan. Good to see you from Serbia. Great to see you from Serbia. I think that that I think that is a new country for us. Let me see here. I don't have Serbia here. I do not have Serbia, so we have to add Serbia to to my list of countries. Great to have you here. Great to have you here. S-E, what time is it in Serbia? R-B-I-A. I love to get all you countries. I love that. See all these different areas that we we reach? 
it's that's my that's my impromptu very official list there all right so once i'm gonna check i'm gonna check on facebook i haven't had anybody comment on facebook yet am i am i live on facebook i gotta check it out and see i want to make sure that my my link is working here yeah that's live and we're on facebook so uh just nobody's commented yet all right i'm gonna draw the box i'm gonna start with the block middle line is going to be a little bit longer here okay i'll zoom this in so you can see it costa rica hello costa rica i wonder if i have i want to see if i have costa rica i want to see do i have costa rica let's see here costa rica that's new for us can you believe it we got two two new countries today thank you guys costa rica make sure i spell it right costa rica r-i-c-a great great to have you here on our on our uh, international drawing lesson chapter one of you can draw in 30 seconds go uphill here and uh, i'm going to move this down just a bit all right go uphill here so we have a box right Got a little box going here. I'm gonna make this house floating. Um, right up now. Th this house is gonna be skinny on one side, wider on the other. That's okay. I'm gonna go right up the middle. Look at this. I'm gonna go right up the middle. Put a guide point right there in the middle. Okay. This is gonna be a real, real simple house. Real fun. Real simple house. And I'm gonna block in. Now this is longer. This one is shorter. Then this line goes up. Remember our drawing directions. Remember the drawing direction compass. That's a regular compass. That's a foreshortened compass. This, these are all explained in the book. You can draw in 30 seconds. Hey, uh, thank you for getting my book. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Make sure you put a uh, a review on Amazon.com when you get that book. Okay? So uh, we're using these directions, these four drawing directions. These are the most important ones that, that I use. That most artists use not all ours but most artists use so we're going to make the the roof of this house slanting down and direction north west now eventually these lines would go across and to a vanishing point the two point we'll get into two point vanishing point system in just a second now so i'm going to draw make sure you slant that down a bit see what i did you know we'll erase these lines for the box yeah this is cute looks like an old-fashioned milk carton doesn't it isn't that fun? All right. Hey, Natalie and Lauren. Hi. I have to lean up to look at it because my glasses are on their last leg. Uh, hey, Steve on Facebook. Hello, Steve. Thanks for sending me a note. All right. So I'm going to put I'm going to put some rows here. I'm going to put some rows of shingles. Okay. And I'm going to put the window. I'm going to draw a real light to begin with. I'm just sketching in the, the shape. I'll darken it in. I'm just sketching lightly the details, okay? Draw all those details. Uh, so, let me see here. Uh, Advise on uh, said they bought the ebook version. Oh, that's great. The Kindle. You bought the Kindle version. That's, that's terrific. All right. So... We have our window. I'm going to put the thickness. The window's on the left side, so the thickness is on the left side. Thickness is on the bottom. I'm going to put a little character hanging out there in just a second. But I'll put the door. I'll just put a little door here, a little doorknob. All right. And I'll darken this in in just a second. All right. That's going to be our house. But now, I want to draw some balloons. I'm going to put. I'm going to put some spheres here. Okay. There's one sphere, and I think I'll draw another sphere. And I'll draw another sphere. This is going to be a floating house, okay? I think I'll put put another one over here. And I'll put, maybe I'll put just a big one right here. You see, I'm just going to put a bunch of spheres that are floating here. I'll put another one right here. Maybe I'll put, put one back behind here. Isn't this fun? Look at, we're just going to put a big giant, this, this big... Big giant uh, bunch of balloons that are just 
all over here. Look at this big. I'll put one floating by itself up here. And I'll put one by itself over here. All right, what do you think? Maybe I'll put one over here. Maybe I'll put one more over here. I can't stop myself. Now, we're going to have to. Isn't that fun? Isn't that cool? We're going to draw this uh, floating house. And the important thing, hey, Jeff Roberts, how are you? The important thing is that we're uh, practicing the sphere, overlapping, shading. Um, we're going to darken in the details. I'm going to, now I'm going to go ahead and darken this in. I'm going to put a little, like a little, uh, a little ring here that the balloons are going to be attached to. All right. So then <clears throat> I think I'll start with this. I think I'll make this balloon the, the closest balloon. So I'll draw this one. And then I'll draw this with the string right down here and tie it, okay? And then I'll erase. That's going to be the nearest one. See what I'm doing here? And then I'll make uh, I'll make this one. This one will be the nearest one for this. Put a little, and I'll draw that string down here. And I'll tie it. Let's see. I have some comments here, so I'll I'll put my glass on temporarily. Uh, Ad, 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 ha! I'm just going to say Adva. Adva says that she's watching my course on 21 Draw. That, I loved, um, uh, that, creating that course. And I see that you, uh, you see it advertised on Facebook. Well, I, I totally recommend it. Of course, I want you to get my membership. I, of course, I want you to get Draw 3D. I think they're both about the same. Um, I think they're both uh, for the for our, the, our met year membership. Mine has four hundred drawings. Of course, all lessons of mine. Twenty one draws, wonderful, really wonderful. You get not only my lessons, but you get about I don't know twenty different artists. So it's it's a really it's a wonderful uh, art education uh, online based learning lessons. I think it's it's uh, based out of the Netherlands, and really, really wonderful people, very talented, everybody's very young, of course, at my age, everybody in the industry is, seems like babies, okay, so I'm just going to keep overlapping, I'm darkening the zed, see what I'm doing, I'm going to use it, so that, the uh, website that we're talking about is 21draw, 21-draw, do a little Google search on that, and I think you'll, you, and there's a there's a bunch of my lessons that are free on that. You can check that out for sure. Same with my Draw 3D. If you go to draw3d.com, you can look at the free lessons. And you wait, wait until the uh, wait until the end of the the lesson today. I'm going to give you a 75 percent off code. Okay. All right. So we're drawing all these spheres, these balloons, this floating house down here. I'm going to draw the draw the horizon line down here. And then underneath here, I'm gonna I'm gonna put the shadow. I'm gonna put the shadow of the the house is floating. Hey Matt, good to see you uh, from Idaho. Hello Idaho. Hello. We have Costa Rica. We have we have Costa Rica. We have Serbia. We have Idaho. All points of the map. Good to see you guys. Day seven. Day seven. Look at shadow. We'll lift that up, and I'm gonna I'm gonna draw draw a little a little character here leaning out of the window. And this fellow here says like, "Hello, hello, hello." I'll darken the sand. Let's zoom in so you can see what I'm doing here. If you're drawing with me, give me a one through five. How are you doing on this? We're we've drawn lightly. Notice how I jump around a lot on my drawings. I'm just having so fun, so much fun, noodling, doodling, guys, noodling and doodling. Hope you're enjoying it. So good to see you, Matt and Jeff and Adva. Hey, I can even see that the comments there on the big screen. Thank you, Mike Ingram, for for making that work for us. That's so cool. All right, so I'm gonna draw some eyes. Little got little little character here. Yay! Put some hair. This, of course, inspired by that wonderful animated movie, Up. Definitely a inspired uh, piece here. 
and then put that hair. Take your time. Doesn't have to be perfect. He's overlapping, coming out. Remember the thickness. If the window's on the left side, the thickness is on the left side, okay? This is our last. Let's take a look again. So we're using, you can draw in 30 seconds book. I hope you all get it for this three-month course. Get it from Amazon. Make sure you put a comment there. <coughs> and um, here we are. We are looking at, <coughs> let's see here. This is what we're doing. We, we're doing the sphere, working our way through the embellishments. Do We're doing the time challenge levels. Look at all these wonderful embellishments. Peak pictures of the Zoom lessons here. And uh, that's what we're doing. We're doing level seven. You're going to uh, level six. You're going to check this off. Then level seven is the eyes. And then level eight, the mechanical chicken foot. We actually did that yesterday. All right. So this is uh, the end of chapter one, all right? And we'll go on to chapter two. I want to thank you guys who have been uh, sending me questions and uh, comments about my school assemblies. If you want me to come visit your elementary school or junior high school or high school or university, go to my website, check out, there's a video that's on the landing page. It's about a 10 minute video and uh, answers a lot of questions that you might have about my personal appearances. I'd love to, love to come to your school, I'd love to. All right, Genghis Khan's 5.5. Good job. All right, so now I'm going to start here, and I'm going to put a row of shingles, and they, the shingles here, they follow those lines loosely, and they get bigger and bigger as they come towards you. They're small here, but they do get bigger, and they're smaller back here, and I'm going to get them bigger. And bigger and then smaller back here and they get bigger and then I'll draw the top of the roof all right how are you doing on this one so now watch us on the other side look I'm gonna draw just you can just barely see the little peekaboo shingles out there see that and that fun and then we'll darken this in there's that house He's waving. Little door here. It's cool little, cool little dwelling. A little doorknob. That fun. <coughs> now, so we 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 sketched in lightly these uh, these spheres or these balloons, right? So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna darken in the ones that are gonna be the closest, and I'll put draw like the little bottom of the balloon here. And I'll draw the balloon strings that are coming down here. All these balloon strings coming through here. I'm going to do a couple more in front. I just kind of made some strings up. I don't think that we have that many strings here, but this one will come down for sure. Darken this. Now, the fun part of this is going to be the shading. It's going to be really fun. Put, make sure you tie it all in. You guys, do you love this one? Isn't this cool? Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. Um, hey, Matt. Great to see you. Anybody else on Facebook, send me a note. Now, Jason Schiller is really good at posting his drawings from the lesson on the Facebook. So... If you guys think about it, take a take a picture of your drawing. Isn't that fun? Take a picture of your drawing and and post it, okay? Post it in the comments of Facebook on my Facebook or Instagram. Post it on Instagram or post it on the on X. Okay? That fun. All right, we got our shadow. Now we're gonna shade it. I'm gonna have the light coming from over here. The light, gee, what a shock. The light's coming from the right side. So I'm going to go ahead and block in the light. So what do you guys think so far? How many of you have have done seven days? How many of you have drawn with me six days? How many of you draw with me five days? Tell me how many days. Even if this is just your first day, just say uh, one day. Say day one. I'm just glad you're here with me. I'm glad you're drawing with me. If you're watching the recording, the posting of this, please uh, let me know how many days you've been drawing, okay? 
Day seven, 365 days, all right? If, are you game for the challenge? Now, even if we miss a day, we're not going to give up. We're not going to throw away the the whole challenge if we miss a day. We're going to keep going, right? Even if we miss a day. But hopefully we'll see. I'm, my whole goal is to get more than 199 days in uh, this year in 2024. Back in 2000, I did 199 days. And those were consecutive days. Those were 190 days in a row that I missed a day. And I had an emotional meltdown. I was like, ah, I missed a day. And I gave up the whole challenge. Well, we're going to see. Let's just see how many days we're going to work our way through all my books. And also, I had a, uh, uh, I had a request to spend a week or a couple weeks drawing the uh, Secret City mural images from the Neverending mural. Mural, remember that from the Secret City days? Maybe we'll do that. Maybe we'll do a do a little a little uh, walk down memory lane, huh? With the mural. I actually have the mural downstairs. The actual, the real mural. All right. Good job. How are you guys doing? Anybody out there with me? Here's Shay here. You guys are so busy drawing that you're not commenting, huh? That's what I like to see. I like to see you guys are focused. See, we're doing we're shading now. We're off with the lights up here. And so I'm I'm putting a light and then I'm gonna darken in opposite. See this? Take your time here. How are you guys doing? Any questions? Spheres are really, really an important drawing shape. There's there's uh Four fundamental shapes that we're going to be talking about, and I even talked about them here in the book. In the very beginning, I talk about the, let's see, there's flat to 3D. Let's see if I know where this is at. Where is it? Where is it? And, ha! Ah, okay, I have to... I have to find out where in my book I put the four elements, the cone, the cylinder, the cube, and what's the fourth one, you guys? What's the fourth one? He helped me. Help me remember. What's What are the four pillars of drawing skill? We have the cube, the sphere, the cylinder, and what is it? Hey, Robert, on... Uh, wonderful. Look, I have to look up. I have to go. Hi, Robert on YouTube. Good to see you. And, uh, oh, you're loving the drawing challenge, right? How many kids, Robert? How many kids are doing the daily drawing challenge with me? Your whole family. I love that. I love that. Now, look what I'm going to do here. I'm going to zoom in. I'm going to put a little more detail here. Now, watch this. I'm going to put a little shading under each of these shingles. It's just a little detail. Can you guys see what I'm doing there? See what I'm doing there? And I'll I will I will darken it, but I'm not I'm, these are gonna be different values, okay? I don't want to make make it pitch black in there because I don't want it, that shirt to disappear. I'm gonna do different values. All right, Robert, I'm so glad that you have your your kids drawing with me and your whole family. That's wonderful. How many in your family? How many are participating? And if anybody else has has more than one person participating, send me a note. Let me know. Thank you for subscribing. Be sure to subscribe to my YouTube. Be sure to like and comment and follow to my uh, Facebook pages and my my ex and my Instagram, okay? My goal, ready for this? One million subscribers in 2024. It could happen. It could happen. That's right. You have four kids. All right. Well, look at that. That's awesome. You guys are drawing. What are, what are their ages? They must. This is a fun one for them. Now, you guys, I'm glad you're loving the daily challenge. If you want to support my efforts uh go you, you go for the draw 3d membership it has 400 focus lessons they're really fun and we also do 
uh, Turbo Tuesday special zooms just for just for family members. And uh, let's let's see here. Let's see if I can put this. There we go. How's that? There's there's the code if you guys are interested. Make sure you go to draw3d.com, go to the family 12 month special, and you get 75% off while I have that code. There it is right there. I'll take it off so we can get back into our drawing lesson. All right. So, wonderful, wonderful. We have our shadow down here. We have shading. I think we're wrapping this one up. I really enjoy drawing. Remember, this is uh, level six of the white pencil club. The white pencil skill level. I call them clubs. They're skill levels. The white pencil. And then next we're going on to the yellow pencil skill level of the boxes. And a bunch of different timed levels to build up your instinct and your confidence and your enthusiasm. Draw, draw, draw. That's right. Isn't that fun? Do you guys like our little, you like our little balloon guy there? Isn't that fun? I love it. Day seven. We made it. Here, let me sign it here. Mark Kessler, you sign yours too, okay? Mark Kessler live. Mark Kessler live. Day 7 of 365. And this is episode... What number? What episode number? I always forget. I have to have you guys... You guys have to help me out. What episode is it? I know the date. I know it's January 7th, 2024. Someone help me remember. I don't even remember. I have to go back and look what I put in the, the text. Uh, 119. Thank you, Jeff Roberts. Oh, by the way, by the way, Jeff Roberts' name reminded me. The uh, <clears throat> the Secret City movies, the Secret Cities of Marcus the movies, you can go to my website. Right there, and it will direct you to Amazon, and you could pre-order a DVD or a Blu-ray. Ah, how exciting. And you go to my website, you can also get the uh, VIP package. Thank you for support. Thank you so much for getting my books and getting uh, my uh, movies and such. Day 7 of 365, that's right. January 7, 2024. Uh... I think, and you know what, I'm going to do one more thing here. You know me, I like to put put a little bit of value at the bottom here. Put a little bit of sky. I like to do that. I want to thank you guys for joining me. You know what's neat is usually within a day, about 24, 48 hours, we have about 500 participants. I can't wait to see that grow to the thousands of you. Thousands of you creative artist drawing a little bit every day one drawing a day okay that's our goal just one drawing a day get your sketchbook out and i would suggest getting a little sketchbook like this spiral binding on the top or the side and just do a page a day you know one page a day just fill it in draw with me you can go back through the the uh, videos and remember if you miss a day miss miss two days don't give up on the whole thing keep just keep doodling Keep doing. Let's see how many. This is uh, the it's the process that counts on this one. I hear my father's voice echoing in my in my head. He was always, he still does. I had lunch with him when I was in California last week, and we talked about that. And how he's still he's ninety years old, and he's still all about the process. The process is important. So this is a salute to uh. The animators of the movie Up. I love, I love, love, love that movie. Powerful story. Isn't that fun? Isn't that cool? All right. Well, thank you guys for drawing with me for day seven. Let me see here. Uh, okay, Renee says, uh, your book finally arrived yesterday. Oh, this is great, Renee. She hasn't missed a day of drawing. Renee, be sure to uh, make a comment on... Uh, Make sure, make sure you make a comment on um, Amazon, okay? You got the book and it changed your life forever. Genghis Khan put a few clouds in the sky. That's cool. You can add that. Add that to your drawing. I'm going to zoom out so you can see it. And uh, 
Thank you so much, everybody, for drawing with me. All right, day eight tomorrow, we begin chapter two of that book right there. Uh, you can draw in 30 seconds. All right, guys, this month for creativity. I'll see you tomorrow. Stay creative, keep drawing, be joyful, and be nice to each other. Bye, everybody.